all right guys you welcome to austin global cosmetic and skincare if today is your first time you did come here i beg don't forget to subscribe like the video and share you hear me if you don't be on our for no day i thank all of you now please always make sure you come to this channel and select watch videos when it will give you sense to make you maybe to only go school go learn skincare you know for those of us who don't get money to go learn now for school we still learn now for youtube anyway let me start today yeah i want to uh, teach us how to make a very whitening soap a very whitening soap when people they call mulatto soap that mulatto soap is true that we have different type of mulatto soap. Are you getting it? Like I told you, I know who invented mulatto soap that is trending everywhere now. I know. Are you getting it? I know because we, I got that day there when they did invent them. So that is why I said, okay, let me quickly just uh, share some of the recipe with you. Don't come and ask me what did you use, what did you put the recipe there. Listen, hold your viral now. Okay, in a quick one, uh, in our mulatto soap, you can use any choice of your own soap. But today we'll be using, look at the uh, rich soap we'll be using. We'll be using about four sets of soap or five sets. First, we'll be using nano half cast. You all know nano half cast is a very whitening or lightening soap when you i mean when you use it consistently not just use it once and say if you use this soap it there is every tendency that it will lighten you and continuously it will whiten you because it's a carrot and you all know carrot carrots you know carrot whites whitening the body yes please so yeah. you see so this one contains vitamin okay vitamin a and c and also papaya and carrot so it's very very uh good so it will lighten the body all right so i will be using uh our uh, bleaching kojic acid plus you know this one also is also very very uh a nice soap and we'll be using this one also gluta c and e are you getting it so all we just have to do this are uh, so this soap you shred them into your bowl shred them this four soap you can add any other soap like i was still gonna add one or two so you shred them and also you add this one to it you know dove you can also add this dove or add uh what is it called baby face are you getting it uh-huh but i prefer using this one so you can shred all of them and put into a bowl right after shredding then we're gonna use this uh, ghana white boss you all know ghana white boss are you getting it this ghana white was a very strong strong soap that people use a lot so i would say okay you will use one just one boss to scatter just scatter one boss on top of the ones you've already you know shred you know then shred them in the bowl put them in the bowl then soak them with small water small water see all what you're soaking for me with small water small water then after that i will advise you because a lot of people they don't uh, have the idea of making uh, a whitening soap they just think you just uh bring this you bring this bring this you, they just do it like the way they feel like you know it's easier for them so after that i would say you should soak together with the other additives are you getting it uh -huh. so after soaking all this one inside a bowl then you must have prepared your powder and i love using a lot of uh, white meat powders for different type of soap but i want to like i've been telling you about this magic powder already so i would want you to use this magic powder or you use giga white or you use any other powder so you take this word this uh well how many soap we're using about six soap right so you take this one just one pinch and soak it with water because it can be dissolved with water or propylene glycol you soak it with water uh, then keep it 
Then after that, we can now say, okay, let's put, uh, we'll be starting with our vitamin E. So you break five of this vitamin E capsule. Vitamin E capsule is very good for the body. It moisturizes the body. You break vitamin E, five capsule inside your soap. All right? Okay. Then after which, we'll be using a... Uh, this uh, concentrate let's put our concentrate so you put your magic demo you put half of this one all right magic demo if you have magic potion you can use magic potion is is i mean uh, it's highly concentrated so use half of it okay it's good for uh, all skin uh, uh, all skin reaction are you getting it yes to clean every dark spot and all that so this one also you use half are you getting it you use half okay you look at the name look at the side you know say i will know i didn't show you okay gluta kojic so you use that one half then you use this one half look at it don't say oh it didn't show me it didn't show me it didn't show me this show me this is your pigeon concentrate you use this one half all right then uh, you use your skin free make you use half you put half also inside a soap all right then you put your uh egg oil or almond oil you put like four spoon so that the skin can glow then you put your alpha abutin you put your alpha abutin you can put the powder you can put this serum all right good so what again this snow white we have different type of snow white powder this one you must have soak it you must have dissolved it also you understand then before then you put your your perfect leg you put three spoon for in case of any other green veins and all that because some people their skin are very sensitive let's be using the word that way sensitive so you put this one then also you put this one your holy i don't know of only these days i mean they kind of change their content what's what is inside is kind of you no know, very bit difficult so to know if it's original or not but this one is original you put three spoon then uh, i think what's good for the body again which is our t3 oil oh, yeah, you put three drops now you cannot put the powder the powder must have dissolved you put this one you put this your magic powder black magic powder and you put this one after you must have dissolved it you put it then what you do properly all of the soap must have soaked already so you use your hand to massage properly properly proper don't forget it's not much much water then you put this one just two spoon all right so you massage properly 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 then let's say let's put some treatment oil which is malawi whitening treatment oil you put two spoon are you getting it then you put shakara treatment oil you put two spoon all right then now you can also okay some people who would want who don't want to put preservative you can have put your fragrance two spoon and don't forget also you cannot put your jama plus preservative you know put like a uh, 50 ml or 40 ml all right so with this we've done this soap is a smart soap if you want to go ahead to add more other uh oils fine because so that to make the soap uh, not just be dried because some people they have dried skin already and this soap definitely if you don't add oils it will sometimes i can also say you should put uh this one like uh, this uh ega oil or almond oil you should put like four spoon because so that the body can easy uh i mean uh glow not just whitening first of all it will moisturize your skin and after that then it will not glow your skin why at the same time whitening your skin that is how your soap is supposed to be especially those of us who are doing whitening soaps are you getting it ahead so those whitening soap then don't forget to put your uh, propylene glycol 
so that the, the soap can penetrate. You hear some people they say, uh, why it didn't work? Uh, you just put it, you wash it from your body, that's why it didn't work. Is that they are allowed to stay in my body for 10 minutes. Your soap must not stay in your body for 10 minutes if you want to know it's very effective soap. Are you getting it? Uh -huh. So you put probably like, or like three spoons, then you leave it for 48 hours to get soap. Everything will soak. Then you cannot use your hand blender or mixer to mix all of the soap because then all the soap must have been, you know, soaked already. So mix them with all the additives you just put. Put them rightly. Then mix them properly. You will see that at the very end of it, or oh, that soap is a perfect soap. Trust me, it's a perfect soap. Don't say I didn't tell you. If you know you can go through all this to make this beautiful, nice soap, all what you just need to do, just place your order via the number on your screen. Are you getting it? We ship everywhere, UK, Europe, Canada, Asia country, US, you know, just name it. Within Nigeria also, we ship everywhere. So that is how to make a mulatto soap, all right? So I have left you with all this so go give it a try and come back to me. Bye-bye.